Darfur State Government has commenced training of 7,500 community police personnel across the state. The State Commissioner of Police, Usman Nagogo, warned trainees against acts of indiscipline. Theophilus Durafai reports. In the face of apparently showing levels of crime and violence in Zamfara State and Enverans, the state government has launched its community policing program. The aim is to involve local communities in fighting crime. The state commissioner of police, Usman Nogogo, told the first batch of trainees that they will undergo combat training in Kaduna and Katsina states. The community policy entails that the community should be involved in securing their environment. This involves all start from the neighborhood. This fastener will be taught rudimentary of the aspects of the act of policing. And with that, they'll be able to be armed to come back and protect their own communities. The state has the highest number of personnel recruited for community policing in the country due to the security challenges in the zone. The state government is to take responsibility for the payment of their salaries. The Inspector General of Police was gracious enough to approve 7,500. This number, I will say without fear or contradiction, is the highest. And the state government will bear the brunt of paying them. Police authorities are confident that community policing will create better interaction and build sustainable partnership between local communities and security agencies. The candidates, according to police authorities, were screened by traditional rulers of their host communities. The police says it will not condone any act of indiscipline and will ensure respect for human rights. Safe as that TVC News, Gusau.